Hello students, how are you? I am Pushkar, Master Teacher in Chemistry at Vedantu and I am going to discuss the next question in J Advanced 2019 Chemistry paper. So let us start with this question. Which of the following statements is are correct regarding the root mean square speed and average translational kinetic energy E average of a molecule in a gas at equilibrium? Four options are given. U RMS is inversely proportional to the square root of the molecular mass. E average is doubled when the temperature is increased four times. U RMS is doubled when the temperature increased four times. And E average at given temperature does not depend on its molecular mass. So this problem belongs to a formula based, a straight formula based problem. So I would say that to answer this question, you need to know these facts very fluently. We know that CRMS is equals to under root of 3RT upon M and we also know that kinetic energy or average kinetic energy is equals to 3 by 2 RT and we also know that half into m into c r m s whole square kind of represents the kinetic energy. So if you know these facts, it's very easy to answer the questions. The first option is u r m s is inversely proportional to the square root of the molecular mass. Of course, it is formula based and you can see that from the formula it is simply reflected that u r m s is inversely proportional to the square root of molecular mass. First option is absolutely correct. The second option is E average is doubled when the temperature is increased four times. Since you can see that E average is directly proportional to temperature. So of course if you double the temperature the kinetic energy will be doubled. So here you can see the temperature is increased four times then E average is doubled this must be a wrong option. Third option is U RMS is doubled when the temperature is increased four times. Yeah, of course, because we have noticed that in U RMS expression there was under root of T. So when the temperature is increased four times, U RMS has increased two times. And E average at a given temperature does not depend on its molecular mass. Of course, this is evident from this relation as you can see that you could not see any molecular property here. So kinetic energy is independent of the molecular mass. So these are kind of pretty straightforward questions based on kinetic theory of gases which you study both in physics and chemistry. So I would say that rate in this question has to be a very simple question and this is the answer A, C and D and this is the possible explanation. So stay tuned for next question and many such more questions with their full explanation. Thanks for watching. Thank you.